Hey, we got a little issue. I didn't go down there and turn the pivot on walk pivot out of the way. I think I messed up. Hey, I'm Ryan with Class, and today we're going to be setting the record for the most amount of corn harvested in a 10 hour period. We have a field here that's approximately 310 acres. It's about a mile long road and has two center pivots in it. So we think we can get it done with the amount of corn that's here, you know. But thinking we can shell it, thinking we can haul it, and thinking we can dump it is three very serious things. Let's do it. Let's do it. Start the clock. Game on. Five, four, three, two, one, go. In 2018, Stuart Farms harvested 54,303 bushels of corn in 10 hours. That's the mark that we want to beat. This has been a year or two in the making, you know, to get this field on this property with this kind of corn on it and get this machine in it. The thing that we really like about the Lexion 8600 is its corn shelling capabilities. It's good in the wheat, it's good in the beans, but we've just really been impressed with how this thing handles corn. Okay, we're hot. About an hour in, how are things looking from your feet? Man, we got her tweaked up pretty good. We've been on schedule. I didn't think we could do it. The first pull was 15 minutes, 1500 bushel. And then the next pull we back in 15 minutes and we just finished that one and it was 11.59. I think we're in good shape, keep pushing. It's awesome that we're in a position where we can build a combine where the customer hops in it for the first time and is immediately like, this is the machine that I could break a record with. And so far we're, we're three or four hours in now and I, I'm feeling pretty good about it. You gotta get it, stay with me. We're running about an 80 to 90 to 100 percent on inch and load. And when we cut that auger on to unload, they got a real fast unload rate on this cross machine. It all boils back to efficiency. You know, whether it's fuel economy, which this thing's great at, or whether it's the efficiency and the grain handling part of it on the machine, it's a farmer's life all the time. You know, we're always trying to get as much done as possible. So we have Cruise Pilot run it. Cruise Pilot is taking a look at the thickness of the crop map coming into the combine, and then it is making determinations on the forward speed based on what it's seeing within parameters that I've set. So you can see here right now, we just unloaded on the go. Uh, so my limiting factor was that we were unloading. I've now switched that off. And so my limiting factor now is that forward speed that I've set. So in order to achieve the goal that we want to achieve today, we need to be somewhere around that 4.4, 4.5 mile an hour. And we are able to get Cruise Pilot running this combine as efficiently as possible in order to achieve that. It's good corn. Alabama. We're gonna break this record for all the southern boys. A lot of these records belong in the north, you know, because they got a lot of corn. We might have a little bit of corn down here too. So we might just go on and get in the game and maybe break a little record ourselves. We're gonna get there. You just gotta stay with it. Yeah. We've got about two and a half hours left to go. 39,000 bushels stored away in the bin. We do have a few concerns that we're gonna run out of corn. 310 acres you'd think would be enough, but the way this combine's eating and the way we're moving through it, I think there is a possibility that we're gonna finish this field before we finish time. It's hot, we're tired, but we're gonna keep pushing and we're positive and hopeful that we're gonna get there.
We had a really good crew. We literally did this, guys, with nine trucks, two grain carts, one combine, and a total of eight or nine guys. Oh, the machine performed great. We look and do it again tomorrow. <laughs> oh. <laughs>